Having high cholesterol puts you at increased risk for heart disease, heart attack, and stroke down the road. While cholesterol-lowering medication is often prescribed to lower risk, many people are looking for more natural ways to reduce their high cholesterol first. The good news is, numerous vitamins, minerals, and supplements have been scientifically proven in clinical studies to reduce elevated LDL bad cholesterol, triglycerides, and total cholesterol levels. Certain nutrients can also safely raise HDL good cholesterol. In this video, I will cover the top 8 vitamins, minerals, and supplements to lower high cholesterol naturally. I'll overview the signs, showing the efficacy, optimal dosing considerations, and precautions for each one. Do watch till the end because combining certain vitamins and supplements can further boost results. So do watch on. And if you like this video, do give us the thumbs up and share it with your friends. Without further ado, let's get started. Niacin or vitamin B3 Also known as nicotinic acid, niacin is a water-soluble B vitamin shown repeatedly to lower LDL cholesterol and triglycerides. The liver converts niacin into NAD and NADP, two coenzymes essential for cellular metabolism including cholesterol synthesis. As an oral supplement, niacin blocks this pathway dose-dependently, effectively reducing production and circulation of LDL cholesterol by 5-25%. to Simultaneously, HDL levels increase by up to 35%, further preventing arterial plaque accumulation. The collective improvements in lipid profiles confer benefits against heart disease. Beyond cholesterol modulation, niacin also reduces chronic inflammation through down-regulating inflammatory cytokines. It assists proper blood clotting as well. Food sources of niacin include poultry, beef, fish, nuts, seeds, and grains. However, consistent evidence supports niacin supplementation for combating high cholesterol above diet alone. 2. Omega-3 fatty acids Found abundantly in fatty fish, omega-3s EPA and DHA provide a multifaceted approach to balanced cholesterol. Rich in polyunsaturated fats, omega-3s decrease liver production and release of triglyceride-containing lipoproteins into circulation. Population studies link regular oily fish consumption to a lower incidence of atherosclerotic events. Beyond regulating lipids, omega-3s also inhibit inflammation underlying plaque buildup and vulnerability to rupture. They further reduce thrombosis risk by making platelets less sticky. For supplemental use, some preparations combine both EPA and DHA for enhanced effects. If using alone, EPA lowers triglycerides, while DHA supports healthy cholesterol particle size and LDL functionality. Those following plant-based diets can still benefit from ALA omega-3s in walnuts, flax seeds, and chia seeds. To find out more about the health benefits of omega-3, do check out my other video here on omega-3's benefits in the link above and in the description box down below. Coenzyme Q10 CoQ10 plays a vital role as an antioxidant, an integral component of mitochondrial ATP energy production. Organs with higher metabolic demands like the heart use CoQ10 extensively. Interestingly, CoQ10 also shares similarities with cholesterol synthesis pathways. Statin medications prescribed for high cholesterol can reduce CoQ10 deficiencies over long-term use. Supplementing CoQ10 helps restore optimal levels for cellular functioning while also lowering total and LDL cholesterol independently by over 10% in some studies. Dietary sources include organ meats, fatty fish, and vegetable oils, but content is relatively low. Those on statins or aged over 40 derive greater cardiovascular protection from daily CoQ10 supplementation alongside standard lipid-lowering treatments. 4. Vitamin C Vitamin C is a water-soluble antioxidant and anti-inflammatory that protects cholesterol particles from oxidative damage, preventing them from becoming stuck in artery walls and forming atherosclerotic plaques. Consuming vitamin C-rich fruits and vegetables has been proven to lower rates of coronary heart disease, stroke, and all-cause mortality. Studies show that those in the top third of vitamin C intake from food have a 34% lower risk of heart disease-related death and a 20% lower risk of stroke. High vitamin C status also correlates with lower carotid artery thickness, indicating less plaque buildup in brain vessels. Supplementing with vitamin C between 500 to 2000 mg per day in divided doses consistently shows improvements in cholesterol markers. However, chronically consuming over 2000 mg daily raises kidney stone risk without added cardiovascular benefit. Consuming 5 or more servings of fruits and vegetables daily provides at least 200 mg of vitamin C, and adding a buffer of 500 mg from supplements a few times a week covers increased antioxidant needs. 5. Vitamin B6 
Vitamin B6, also called pyridoxine, plays a key role in amino acid metabolism and red blood cell production. It further facilitates over 100 enzyme reactions throughout the body. In relation to cholesterol, vitamin B6 increases LDL receptor expression in liver cells to enhance LDL clearance from circulation. Homocysteine detoxification also requires B6 to convert it into cysteine and avoid atherosclerotic effects from accumulation. Supplement studies demonstrate vitamin B6 doses between 50 to 200 mg daily significantly lower LDL cholesterol and raise HDL over just a few months. However, be mindful that excessive single nutrient supplementation can potentially cause nerve damage over time. 6. Folic Acid Folic acid of vitamin B9 aids essential cell processes like DNA synthesis and supports red blood cell production. But it also facilitates conversion of homocysteine into harmless amino acids. Rapidly proliferating cells require adequate folic acid, making it particularly important during pregnancy to ensure proper neural tube closure. Meta analyzes compiled results from numerous studies on folic acid effects on cholesterol collectively. Findings show folic acid supplementation between 500 to 5000 mcg per day consistently lowers LDL cholesterol by approximately 12% across large sample sizes. Common food sources include leafy greens, legumes, avocado, citrus fruits and nuts. Address any deficiencies with daily supplementation as well. Seven, vitamin B12 Vitamin B12 supplements can help people with deficiency in cholesterol levels by reducing LDL bad cholesterol and total cholesterol. Vitamin B12 plays a role in managing homocysteine levels and regulating cholesterol biosynthesis. Studies show that dosages ranging from 500 to 1000 mcg per day are effective in cholesterol reduction. Vegans and strict vegetarians are at high risk for deficiency due to its presence in animal foods. Even meat eaters can develop inadequacies due to poor stomach acid secretion. Testing blood levels is crucial for those concerned about deficiency and adults over 50 who absorb B12 less efficiently. Sublingual tablets, lozenges, and periodic B12 shots may be needed to restore optimal values due to poor digestion. If you are wondering if you suffer from vitamin B12 deficiency, do check out my other video on vitamin B12 deficiency symptoms in the link above and in the description down below. Eat selenium Selenium is a trace mineral with potent antioxidant capabilities that concentrates in cell membranes. Here, it prevents oxidative damage to lipids and regulates inflammatory cascades damaging to vessels. Selenium acts as a cofactor for glutathione production and glutathione peroxidase activity. This selenoenzyme catalyzes the breakdown of hydrogen peroxide and lipid peroxides that would otherwise accumulate in atherosclerotic lesions. Population studies link higher selenium status with substantially lower cardiovascular disease and improved cholesterol profiles, especially in those already deficient. Brazil nuts, eggs, poultry, and seafood provide excellent selenium sources. Controlling cholesterol through nutrition and lifestyle modifications should be the first-line intervention before resorting solely to prescription medications. Combining vitamins like niacin, B6, and folic acid alongside minerals like selenium and nutritional compounds like fish oil, plant steroids, and fiber provides a safe, multi-targeted strategy to lower LDL and total cholesterol levels naturally. Consistency remains key as well as getting regular blood lipid testing to monitor progress. But for those struggling with genetics and other lifestyle factors, making sure you get adequate amounts of these top 8 nutrients can make a major difference. When combined with daily exercise, a Mediterranean style diet and stress reduction practices, achieving optimal cholesterol levels is within reach. Do you take any of these vitamins or supplements? Comment below. If you enjoyed this video, do like and share this video so that more people will learn about these amazing nutrients to lower cholesterol naturally. Check out this playlist of my top 10 videos of health tips for women and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.